¿Qué tal gente? Acá estamos con la tercera parte del Soma eh, Vamos a ver Habíamos terminado que nuestro amiguito nos salvaba Habíamos escapado de que se teletransportaba <risa> Bueno, aquí estamos Vamos a ver qué son los cangrejos. <risa> ¿Qué hay acá? El chupadedo. Bueno, una palanca en medio del mar. ¿Qué puede pasar? No se mueve. Uy, me caigo. Me caí. <risa> Ay. Me faltaba acá caer en palanca. Veamos qué pasa. Esto delta. A ver, estamos acá. Antena de comunicaciones. plataforma me llevaría teta a ver vamos a ver ahora no se cae ahí está debería ser por aquí será todo esto sala de control A ver. no entro Ahí. el robot pero no tiene la luz roja esto A ver qué encontramos. Abrite. Muerto. <ríe> no sé nada. Lumaranes. ¿Qué será eso? Ah, 
acá está el transporte. ¿Y esto? Sin especificar. Zeppelin. 049. Detenido. Ocho cuarenta de si esto antena error pérdida de posición de transporte ajustar la antena radio dos mil trece y dos mil ciento cuarto Without the positioning system, the Zeps just keep losing their set roots. Volchek did say that you could have fixed it on your side by rejigging the antenna. That's all right. I think I'm going to call it the Zeppelin. Dedo. Baño. Acá no hay nada. Eh... No sé. Epsilon Delta, Teta, Omicron. Omicron. a ver qué más encontramos ¿En dónde habría está? Ah, pronto, aquí. Al para X. Y acá sale sangre. ¿Estará acá el muerto? No se puede abrir. ¿Un ajedrez? Va. No dejo jugar. ¿Y eso? Los ojos. Mm. Tengo un ojo. <ríe> ¿Me lo llevo? Agarrarlo. 
Entonces, 216. Vamos a ver qué eran los números estos. A ver. Antena 216 acá. Tengo que ir a teta. Ese no es. Vamos con el 049, que está para allá. A ver. Vamos a ver. Sí. 0.49 A ver ahora Transport active Unspecified cargo Entrante, ahí está Zeppelin's on its way Gotta get ready Tengo un arma y un muso. ¿Dónde está el robot? No, este es mi amigo. Vamos a buscar otro. Allá está. Venga para aquí. Pero en este caso, tenía que ser hecho. Él 
talking. I mean, he was delusional, but he seemed sincere. Present. Yeah, well, I'm sure it's fine. Was he really that different from us? It's just beginning to sink in. I mean, really sink in. I'm a robot. Didn't we cover this already? I guess I've known ever since I woke up at Upsilon. I just keep suppressing it. Like my brain doesn't want me to think about it. It's really getting hard not to think about it. Yeah. Could you maybe hit that switch over there so we could get moving? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> Sí, bueno, ya callaste, dice. <ríe> ah, ya no tengo mi arma. ¿Dónde voy? ¿Para por acá? Ah, está. You're really good back there, Simon. We got a slight delta detour, but we're back on track. Yeah. We should touch down on a cargo platform just outside Theta. Then we just head inside, grab the duck back, and head down the abyss. 4,000 meters. That's a long way. We don't have to worry though, because with the Dunbat, the Ark could have been in the Mariana Trench. It'll hold for anything. That's great. And then we can start listening to other people when they talk, because that's how conversations work. What? Oh, sorry. I just can't stop thinking about what we've become. It's clear that we're no longer human. But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? I mean, technically, I don't have any ears, no mouth. Christ, that's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. <sighs> okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cope? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and then go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omni tool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Uh, Kath, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh huh, yeah, the warden unit, the WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. It's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside data, okay? See you soon. Por fin llegamos aquí. Ahora. Mi amiguito no vino. Strasky, wake up Dr. Masters. We're bringing in anchors. What's wrong? What can I say? He's had a rough day. Jesus Christ. He's all butchered by structure shrapnel. The bio sure did a number on him. Brandon, flip the panic switch on the seat. I don't want to burn through the oxygen. You're kidding, right? He's fucking hanging on by a thread. We need to move him. Strasky, get the infirmary ready. We need to move fast. Wait. Where are Comoravia and the others? This is all we got. I guess it's still at Delta. Yeah, I can't do this on my own. Grab the other side. Strask, ready or not, we're coming in. All right. 
you up to this? Killing yourself? Catherine Chun? <laughs> no. I don't think you understand. She just did scans and put them into the Ark. I hope I get to meet her soon so I can apologize. She always got into trouble with Strawmire when someone killed themselves. I think she's okay with it. Where is everyone? I thought there would be like 40 or 50 people here. I don't know. Uh, I'll let you know if I see anyone. Robin, I'm not sure how to say this. What? This... This is... Yeah? Pretty amazing, right? <laughs> I mean, the Ark. Yeah, it's great. Catherine and the guys have really pulled through. They saved us all. <laughs>
pasó si has querido trabar? Hello? Anyone there? Well, Catherine, we found Theta. Here. Okay, great. Time to hijack ourselves a submarine. There will be nothing stopping us when we have the done that. You guys sure have a lot of machines and vehicles down here. What makes this one so special? It's the only transport that can go into the abyss without cracking like a can of soup. If this is one of a kind, then how did they get the Ark down the abyss in the first place? That's a good question. I suppose they did it the hard way and just walked. Didn't realize that was an option. <laughs> Kath, what's it like inside the Ark? Is it like a movie or virtual reality? No, of course not. It's, you know, like real life, but slightly better. Pleasant temperature, clean air, good weather. So people in the Ark just walk around pretending it's the real world? You don't have to pretend. It's perfectly immersive. La Matrix. And it can just sustain itself. Yes. Attached to a probe fueled by solar panels, it can survive for thousands of years. That's amazing. Just... Thinking about the Earth being what it is, and us setting out to save the final remains of humanity, it's... It's... Heroic? Uh, at least it feels worth doing. Here we go. The Dunbat! Ah, oh, damn it. I knew it was too good to be true. What's wrong? It's... It, it's quarantined. Hold on. We need a security cipher. How bad is it? It's we don't write these things down type of bad. Maybe someone's still around who could tell us what it is. Hmm. Sure, let's go with that. I'll just unlock the other doors for you so you can explore the station. Tengo que llevar? No. A ver. Limpio mapa, nivel principal. Uf, bastante grande. Looks like all your friends moved downstairs. Why abandon the gate? In the habitat? That's so strange. La Fox Beacon. I don't like this at all. Es bastante grande. Bueno, hay que buscar un código. Ya se podía entrar por la puerta. Why would they all leave this floor? I don't get it either. It's like they all just cleared out. I know. It's real. Me parece que voy a abrir esto y me va a salir un monstruo, ¿sabes? Vamos a ver ya primero que hay. No 
so. What's so interesting downstairs? Just labs and offices. Maybe the shuttle station. Should we go check? Rather not. Got a bad feeling about this. la sensación de que algo me está siguiendo, no sé. No me puede avisar dónde está el monstruo. Simplemente me está viendo por las cámaras. Mira, cada vez paso por aquí suena eso. Ah, está todo cerrado. Ya veo que se abra todo. Cadre. Hey, that's my room. You want me to bring something? A souvenir? No, it's just memories. Teddy Bear could use some repairs. Toby always breaks. He's top heavy, so he keeps falling over. Martin Fisher. Quiero abrir esas puertas. Un gato. Parecido a mi gata. <ríe> Igual te. ¿Qué mierda? Mm. Bueno, ¿Y dónde estará la contraseña? Nada. 
Welcome to my place. When I started the art project, I pretty much lived in this lab. Cozy. You too. What? Pero no objeto. Reinicial route. Reiniciar ruta. Todo acá. Need to fix that mainframe connection. This is where I would store the arc scans. So you saved the whole staff digitally on these chips? That was the plan. Broken. algo que saque todo esto hay uno an intact memory chip if we're lucky we might be able to extract the cipher from it bueno ahora me falta la conexión ¿Dónde estará el router? Vamos a ver allá. This is where I did my scan. And all the others, I suppose. You don't remember? My scan was the first. Had to test the scanner before I could start making promises. Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab, the scan room. What happened? Conrad killed. Oops. What? Shooter in the camera of the sub-nivel or contact with the service. In the camera of the sub-nivel. Ah, I see. What? Check the terminal. I just want to make sure. Borramos todos los datos. Sujeto de la japonesa eliminado. Seguimos borrando. Munchy. ¿Qué es esto? What is this? Why do you have a file of me? You are one of Dr. Munchie's templates. A legacy scan. Okay, that's it. Wow, that was fun. That's a relief. 
Still figuring this out, so... This freaking so many lights. What do we do now? Paul and I are gonna run tests for a week or so, and then we'll work out a roadmap to your recovery. Well, I feel excited. Can't wait to get back to the living. We've worked everything out. Everything is legal. Vouched for by Dr. Peak and Professor Wei. Oh, that's great news. No big change in medication. You'll be taking an aspirin every morning, but that's about it. Paul worked out a diet with some variations you should try out. You can continue doing physical therapy. Also, there's some extra cardio training every other day. Okay, getting complicated. Don't worry, it's really not. We're gonna keep an eye on you every week, so we'll be able to adjust the plan if needed. The model was sound. It should have worked. It's not your fault, David. I really wish things had turned out differently. Yeah, me too. I was supposed to save you. Hey, Eduardo? you got my brain on file. Maybe you can put it to some use. <laughs> yeah, who knows? You'd be okay with that? Using it for my research? Sure. It's like a part of me lives on or something. Like a donated organ. You know what sucks about dying? What? The crash. Everything up till now. The brain damage. You guys, everything. It's made my life so much more real. I started thinking about all the things I was going to do. I'd never been more excited to be alive. All that hope. Wasted. <laughs> What's a legacy scan? They're historic templates for AI construction. Any self-respecting engineer wouldn't use legacies anymore, but they're great for learning. They come with every development kit. So, my brain scan turned into a template for artificial intelligence. You should be proud. So much for that mystery. No magic or time travel needed. I was here all along. Waiting for someone to shove a picture of my brain into a suit and hit the power button. Aura. He's dead, Kat. The real Simon is dead. And I'm a replica of that scan Munchie did, thinking he's Simon. What did you expect? I don't know. I, I don't know what I was hoping for. An explanation? Maybe an apology? Oh, uh, I I'm sorry. Not from you. I, well, thanks, I guess. I deleted the file, so hopefully I'll be the last Simon to suffer through this place. Ready to move on? Yeah. Let's go. In the sub level, I have to look. And now, where do I go? Hijo de su madre, ahí atrás. Seguro es de que abrió puerta. El modem. Seguro tengo que ir por esa puerta. Qué barro. Acá tienen pinta de, de que puede estar el modem. ¿Y este? Sigue vivo.
Es un maldito laberinto. Uy, ya está. ¿Y dónde reinicio el modem? Ay, la puta madre, un laberinto. Encontrar la salida después. Finisher el router, ¿dónde está? ¿Y? Acá. Corre, ahí está. Ya estará. Tengo que apretar de vuelta el botón, creo. Ahí está. Ahí está. Error. Ay, la puta madre. No puedo hacerlo. Ay, la puta madre. Ahí está, qué hijo de puta, no me deja salir. No me deja salir, me va a matar. Se dio vuelta. Uh, el camino por ahí. Ahí viene de vuelta. Yo no puedo prender la luz. ¿Ya me vio? Ay. Alejate.
ammo. Supongo que ya está. Supongo que está. No sé. Me voy para arriba. Ay. Espero que se haya, sido, se haya sido todo. Qué fe esa parte. Uh, y ahora. Acá arriba. Necesito un chupa de doggy. Aunque ahora es chupa puños. <ríe> Puño entero. The legacy scan of me that was on the computer. What did you use it for? It's a template that has an intelligence pathway already etched into the base. So, if I wanted to build an AI, I wouldn't have to reinvent a whole model. I would be able to focus on the things that the AI is to be used for. Is every AI self-aware? They also think they're Simon? What? No, Simon. What? Don't worry. It's not like we just put people into robots and machinery and let them run free. That'd be really cruel. It there should be a list of people. See if there's anyone who could know a security cipher. Oh, y ahora dijo que me ayudaría a entrar al arca. No, it won't work. We need someone from Data Security Group. Group of Security Z. Cronster o Stroymar. Cronster o Stroymar. Vengo con No, I don't think so. Stroymar recruited people from the evacuated sites. They should also know the cipher, if you can find one of them. Que necesito otro chip. Ok, try actually reading the info and then pick one. <ríe> ya se enojó. Autor Kaderin Chun. Este Stroimer dice ahí. Very promising. I'll just load him up and get the simulator going. There we are. What are we doing exactly? We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation.
¿Y ahora? Playa. A ver, había otra computadora allá. Esto. Capaz que tengo que cargar algo más aquí. de pruebas Scan meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. 
And we turned him off. Took it all away again. I really thought that was gonna work. Maybe we can try again. That wasn't so bad. <sighs> mm hmm. No sé. Have I the chip de eso por qué? Algo falta. Módulo. Módulo de asistencia. Nada, dice. A ver. Falta algo. That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. What? Where did it? Alice? Congratulations, Mr. Wan. The scan was successful. Chun? Where's Alice? She left. Mr. Wan, I need you to give me the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is the trick. Please, this is important. I know you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me while you're here. Simon, what the hell? We need to do this. No funciona. Necesito otro módulo. A ver. Capaz que... Como me embola, che, da vuelta así. I think Brandon Wan is a good lead, but we need to find out more about him. See if you can't get to know him a little. Have a look in his room, go through his stuff. I can do that. Ah, no, de acuerdo. The one. Here we go, Brandon Wan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. If we get to know him, maybe we can make the simulation a little smoother. Brandon mentions a girl named Alice. They did their scans together. Alice Coster? We could try to make him think that she's there during the simulation. Might make him talk. Not sure how, though. Keep looking. Cute. I'll borrow to pack up their stuff. Head downstairs, I'll meet you there. Don't take too long. Don't worry, we're right behind you. I think I just heard Alice talking to Brandon on the intercom. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. You got that from the intercom? 
Must be a transmission buffer. Hang on. Great, this is exactly what we need. I think we got this, Simon. I can synthesize Alice's voice from the intercom and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. We can trick them into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely <laughs> feeling good about this. Good job with the intercom. I didn't know you could data mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. So it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. Alice, por So she'll be with Brandon in the simulation. Sort of. I'll still need to do the talking, but it'll sound and look like Alice. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. No, or lo dejo. Ah, no, lo voy a dejar por la duda. Papá que en algún momento se lo puede volver a necesitar. Es el monstruo, ya estoy viendo. Sounds easy enough. Ah, 
I sent you follow. No sé qué habrá pasado Pero bueno Ahí me voy a dejar la parte 3 <risa> Bueno, espero que les haya gustado eh, Si les gustó Suscríbanse al canal y denle like Sí, me ayudan un montón. Sí, ya nos vemos en la parte 4.